Hello everyone, this is Moshe, the Electric Israeli, and thank you for joining my channel. If you're new, please subscribe and help me change the world one electric car at a time. Thank you to all my patrons and those who ordered the Tesla using my referral code. And I want to congratulate Dion and Steven who just got their Tesla after they used my link. So they are happy and I'm very happy. Uh, so let's move on to Cybertruck. There is so much talk about the Cybertruck as if as if there's no other cars produced in the world and and it is such an amazing topic it looks like according to all kinds of calculations and and all kinds of reservation order numbers and serial numbers and whatever that is that the cyber truck is now up to 550,000 reservations so there's a couple issues first of all uh we don't know how many actual buyers this will translate. I mean, if all goes according to plan, Tesla is going to start producing in end of 2021. All right. Now, as opposed to the Model 3 reservation, which was $1,000, meaning the stakes were much higher. I put $1,000 the first day it was available. Uh, and I waited two and a half years. So obviously the stakes were higher. So the conversion rate, it uh, was much higher because it's just you you're not gonna put a thousand dollars just because you say ah maybe I'll change one that's, that's a lot of money the model Y was even even more difficult because this was twenty five hundred two thousand five hundred dollars and that is really really high stakes that's a lot of money now Tesla model Y since the last two months you can uh, uh, make a reservation for a hundred dollars but it's non-refundable and I did, I have done that. So I, I did reserve the Model uh, 3 and I waited. Model Y, I just did a couple months ago. And of course, the Model, uh, the Tesla Cybertruck, I did the reservation right away. Now I am a buyer. I did buy the 3, I did, I will buy the Y, and I will buy the, uh, the Cybertruck. But there are a lot of people, oh, you know, this is so cool, it's only $100, let's do it. Maybe I'll put two reservations, one for this uh, model and one uh, for this trim and one for that trim. I can do that. Let's say just for argument's sake that 50% of the uh, reservation holders will renege. We're still talking about over 250,000. That's gonna take Tesla, and that's not me saying, that's Elon Musk saying, uh, probably four years to uh, 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 produce and deliver mainly mainly because of battery ability to uh, the ability to produce as many batteries as possible that is the biggest challenge not the, from the technological point of view but from the physical point of view the actual manufacturing putting all the raw materials together and putting into a cell and putting that cell into a pack okay it's just enormous task because tesla produce and sells so many Model 3s and, and Model Y, that's gonna be very interesting and insane. So, uh, uh, however, the uh, intrigue of the Tesla Cybertruck is so great. I never owned a pickup truck in my life and I never thought that I would ever uh, reserve the, the, the Cybertruck. I mean, I, for months I said, why, why, I, I never do. What do I do with pickup truck? Why am I uh, a painter? Or a contractor? No, I don't do these things. But when I saw it, after the initial shock and awe, I was like, wait a minute, this is something really special. The, the exoskeleton, the uh, seating arrangement, the look, the cyberpunk style, the lighting, the lighting, the vault, uh, the, uh, the, the, the outlets, the range, the performance, and of course the price, you gotta, you gotta take that into account as well, the price of the three trims. So that was very, very intriguing. And I'm sure there are a lot of people like me, non-truck people that do that. Now, talk, talk about uh, pickup truck people. You know how it is. America, it's like one of the hottest segments in America, the small SUVs, the, uh, the pickup trucks. It is a huge, huge market. So if I have to predict how many would sell, I will always, always, always go with the short thing, which is a 50% conversion rate. Now, it could be more. I am telling you, once they are on the street and people see them and people start to drive them and people start to be in them, they said, wait a minute, I want to be part of this. 
So it could be even more. You never know. What do you think? Huh? What do you think would be the percent of conversion of the Cybertruck reservation holder? I'm interested to know your opinion. Thank you guys for watching. Give me a thumbs up. And I'll see you tomorrow.